This is a Baytion interactive cat toy. Have you ever wasted money on a trendy TikTok or Instagram find and regretted it? Well, in this video, I'm going to explain why we bought this toy twice, what led us to it, and give you the facts on whether this toy is for you and your cats. Also, did you know that 71% of TikTok users said they bought something after stumbling across a product in their feed? Let's chat about why this trend could be trouble for cat toy enthusiasts and equip you with tools to avoid wasting your money. Before we get into it, my name is Ashley, a proud cat dad. To keep things simple, I've split this video into two sections. Firstly, we'll run through our concerns with TikTok buys. And secondly, we'll chat about the toy and our toy comparison chart, which we've spent the last two months building so you can save money and improve playtime with your fur babies. Did you know that the pet market has quadrupled since 2013? We're spending more on pet supplies, treating our pets like family. I mean, look at this, I've ordered cat toy bananas 17 times on Amazon. Sadly, they don't count as one of my five a day. This trend is accelerating with social media marketplaces perfect for impulse buys, but it's scary because it's hard to confirm the quality and safety. Take the shopping influencer on TikTok who said this when being asked why she's not selling more on TikTok. To avoid disappointment and ensure your cat's safety, we've started doing at least one of these three things. Firstly, check in other marketplaces like Amazon for review ratings and from other various sites. Summaries and key links above the review section often help to quickly gauge the product and filtering on three star reviews often provides balanced perspectives to assess if the drawbacks really matter to your cats. Secondly is ChatGPT. It's incredibly powerful at providing cat toy overviews and personal recommendations. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know another AI recommendation, but look, check this out. If we pop this prompt in, we get the following. It's cool, isn't it? But what if your cat is elderly and say you want to check whether this toy is suitable? Well, we can follow the prompt up with this. Feel free to edit and play with these prompts. We found that this method is the fastest way of getting the information we need, but it can often make mistakes. That's why we also do the third option, YouTube reviews. Look, I know, of course, I was going to say that, but I guess the entire reason you're here in the first place is because you're similar to us. So how do we find this toy? Well, my wife is easily swayed by a good marketing spill. And when she saw this toy on TikTok promising heaps of joy for our feline friends, she just couldn't resist. So when it finally arrived, she was practically bouncing off the walls of excitement. At first glance, it seemed like a solid little toy, but as we delve deeper, we uncover some not so pleasant surprises. But first, let me quickly show you the features of this toy. The thing is compact, doesn't weigh as much as you'd think, and the outside is made of this silicone material that feels a little bit like rubber, and it's pretty durable. Plus, it's got a simple USB-C connection for charging, which is pretty convenient, right? When it comes to playtime, the toy really shines and it has two settings to maximize play. The first is where it will automatically move for five minutes and then just stops. The second is a bit more intelligent. So the toy moves for five minutes and then stops, but this time it can be reactivated if knocked and then goes for another five minutes of play. When it's on, it zips around all on its own, which drives our cats absolutely bonkers. They love swatting it, chasing it under furniture and watching it pop back out like a little magician. It's pretty good entertainment for them, although we do find ourselves after constantly fishing it from under things. But, and there's always a but, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. See, this toy has a few major flaws which significantly impacts its place on our score ranking chart. Stay tuned so you don't miss that. Our final verdict, the price, and also our buy recommendation. Firstly, its battery life sucks, and once it's dead, it's game over. Our cats will not play with it, so it will require constant recharging. Secondly, if you've got carpet or rugs, this toy will not work. Lastly, and by far and away the biggest issue, is that the first ball just turned out to be a dud within a few days. The online review suggests we're not the only ones. Clearly, both us and our cats were completely gutted. Okay, let's score this toy and see how it compares on our toy comparison list. Style, it's cool looking and makes a change from the usual ugly cat toys that stand out like sore thumbs. So it gets a seven out of 10. For engagement, when it's up and running and not stuck, our cats love it, keeping them engaged. So it gets a seven out of 10. Quality, worst rated by far. The battery dies too quickly and breaks in record timing. So it gets a one out of 10. Safety, we haven't had any problems, but I'm concerned our cats could bite through the charging flap and into the electrical section. Plus it looks like a bit of a butt flap. So it gets a five out of 10. Attraction, the cats only engage when it's switched on and in motion. It's a tad too weighty for them to initiate play by themselves, unlike a spring toy. So it gets a five out of 10. 
cleanliness, it gathers dust and fluff more than you'd believe, although the surface does wipe clean easily, so it gets a 6 out of 10. This gives the Beige an interactive cat toy a score of 31 out of 60, positioning at the bottom of our list. If they could just solve a few of the problems, it could be a really good hit toy. So, should you buy it? save it for later or simply ignore it. We ended up buying a second one mainly because we wanted to give it another chance. Our cats love it and it's amazing distraction when your cats get the zoomies. But for you at £10 and considering the drawbacks, I just can't recommend this toy. I really just don't want to waste your money. So ignore it. If we have a better experience with this one, we'll return to the video and pin a comment to the bottom to update you all. Thank you for watching. But what if I told you there's a better interactive cat toy that scores significantly better in our chart and doesn't cost much more than this? Go and check out this video here. Click one of the links in the video description if you want to find out more about the toys mentioned. Anyway, thank you for watching and see you soon.